Even with car and catalytic converter thefts on the rise, offenders often go back on the street without much jail time. Coin 6 is looking into one case for a man already facing charges in Multnomah County wasn't even held in jail. Our Lindsay Nadrich going beyond the headlines now. She tracked that man down. So where was he? Well, he's now in jail in Clackamas County. The man's name is Joshua Ephraim. He has a lengthy criminal history and in one case from December 2020, he's facing 20 charges related to catalytic converter thefts and wasn't held in jail for that case. In that case, court documents say Ephraim was caught cutting the catalytic converter off someone's Honda Element outside their home. Then the next day, documents say he stole someone's catalytic converter while their car was parked in the economy lot at the airport. Documents say he's also tied to three other catalytic converter thefts at the airport and four catalytic converter thefts that happened in the parking garage at Providence on Northeast Gleason. Prosecutors say these cases are frustrating for their office and for law enforcement. Let's say we were able to charge them uh, because we were able to prove it beyond a reasonable doubt and we charged them. And then they pick up another case and another case and another case. I mean, it is, it does seem like a small percentage of people are committing the majority of the stolen car cases. While waiting for officers to show up for one of the catalytic converter thefts at Providence, documents say Ephraim told security, this is Multnomah County. I'll be out and back here in no time. Ephraim wasn't wrong. He wasn't held in jail on that case. And while awaiting trial, he's since been arrested six more times. Again, he's currently in Clackamas County Jail. But how is this allowed to continue happening? I'll have the answer coming up at 5 and 6. Reporting live on Lindsay Natterich, Point Six News. Absolutely, so frustrating, Lindsay. Thank you. Now, earlier.